And we know how hard it can be to make ends meet right now. And that can have all of us looking forward to retirement, right? But, yeah, are you prepared for that day in what is now considered a bear market? Channel 3's Dawn G is here to help us uh, with take some of the fear out of our 401k. We all know you run the risk of losing money in the stock market. Stocks go up and stocks go down. The stock market is simply going through a down period right now, and that hurts, especially when it's your investments you see plummeting. Advice, only check your 401k one to two times a year if you're comfortable with what you've selected. If you are nearing retirement, the game is different for you. The economy, it ebbs and flows. Right now, the experts say the health of the U.S. economy is suffering from high inflation, tight labor markets, and the lingering effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. I mean, we do have inflation at 40-year highs. Um, interest rates are going up and the market is down. And so it, it, it's this trifecta, if you will, of a perfect storm that has a lot of people concerned and worried. Many are concerned, worried, and wondering what the current economic climate will mean for their investments and their 401k. We're officially in a bear market, and that basically means that the market is down more than 20% from its high. It can be stressful, downright alarming to watch helplessly as your portfolio slowly declines in value. There's not much you can do about either the stock market or the economy as a whole, but you can try to make adjustments when you can, if you can. And when you find yourself in a down market and you're, in the, and you're not close to retirement, you should hold tight. The stock market has proven it will bounce back eventually. Marcus Warren of Warren Wealth Management and Tax Planning says the most important thing an investor can do during a bear market is to wait it out if you are not retired or close to retirement. Don't focus on daily declines, but on your long-term goals. So for those who have a longer time horizon, basically don't make any changes keep on doing what you're doing because it should pay off in the end. If retirement is in your near future, so should changes to your 401k as soon as possible. If you uh, have found yourself in this turbulent market close to retirement and losing money, then you might want to make some minor reallocation changes. As you get closer to your retirement, you should be shifting your portfolio toward more conservative investments. Those funds will have less growth potential, but they will also be less volatile. Do most people know what, the, what investments they have? And unfortunately, the answer is, is no. And that's why as people get closer to retirement, they should be taking a lot of that risk off the table. You just can't afford to go into retirement with less money. Withdrawing money early from your 401k can result in hefty IRS tax penalties. In the long run, it's probably not worth it. Once you turn 59 and a half, you can withdraw any amount from your 401k without paying a penalty. Consider talking to a financial advisor about investment strategies and protecting your 401k, especially as you near retirement. Also, as you near retirement, shift to safer, more conservative investments. Until then, stay the course. What goes up comes back down. Helping you make ends meet. I'm Dawn G.